Those vegan guys. I thank you. Well, hello, my darlings. It's uh, is it Wednesday? It is. Yes, Wednesday evening, and uh, tonight we decided we were going to finish off those. Do you remember when I got those uh, no birth bourguignon pies from Aldi? And I put two in the freezer and we had two that night and did a taste test on them. It's one of our past uh, meal vlogs. Well, we're having another two tonight with mashed carrot, a little bit of margarine, some salt and pepper, chopped steamed greens, peas and sweet corn. A delicious dinner. How are you, Mr. Jason? I'm fine. I'm you fine did. Fine and dandy. You just edited a video when you got home from work and we've got it up with your lasagna yes. taste test and four of our meals. So this vlog here, Jason, this will be the first meal of a new one. It will. And what a meal to start on. It's good that we're uh, we're managing to keep track a bit better now, isn't it? It is. <laughs> Dinner, my darlings. What, do you know I do like a pile of veg sometimes, but being northern, especially with a pie and a bread and a pie. Bye. Well, hello, my loves. It's uh, Thursday evening. Jason's finished work. Yay! <laughs> and he's booked Monday off again. So that's great. Well, you know what? When all's said and done, um, we are actively being encouraged to take more, encouraged more to take annual leave because yeah. of everything that's going on at the moment. Absolutely. And, you know, we're, uh, we're a mental health Sh charity. Should have made it a couple of days. Well, you know. I'll save a bit. I know. For when the world gets back to normal. I suppose. So, um, we've had these, the Vegilantes chicken ticker in the freezer for ages. We've already tried the popcorn chicken. Uh, the Vegilantes is a product range available at Morrison's. We've featured in our last uh, Morrison's vlog, the January one. I'll link it up there now. Uh, and I've done a rice. I've just, uh, I've boiled... Um, uh, some brown rice and I've done a stir fry mix in the pan of uh, green pepper, red onion, red cabbage, peas and sweet corn with some curry spices and some fresh chilli and uh, there's a paratha in the air fryer. Out to say Um You bonny man. Oh, I forgot how to say. Um, I tell you what I will say. What? I'll say this. I thought about this earlier on because of the way that our our meal vlogs um, have let, and because of the weekend and the last taste test I did for my lunch. Yeah. The next meals vlog might not have a lunch taste test from me. Oh. So I'm sorry in advance. Maybe we'll do a. Maybe we'll do a, a TVG lunchtime taste <laughs> test at home. Meow. <laughs> uh, so there you go. The, do you want to try one of them chicken ticker ones, Jason? Because we've already, yeah, we've already tried the popcorn chicken. Mm. Um, so it's meant to be, you know, chicken ticker style balls. There's only eight in a box. So this is it. That's why I've done the popcorn chicken as well. I was like, hmm. Does it have ticker flavor? Oh, it's a bit confused. Oh, something's gone wrong, Mildred. Hmm. I'm giving it a second. Okay. I'm not texture. keen on the texture. It's got a weird texture to it. And it's not massively flavoursome either. No, it tastes a bit like, um, it feels a bit like a stuffing ball. Yeah. Mm. The texture's really odd. This is a strange one with the, this particular um, brand. Because uh, yeah, I know. They, they've been really good and I'm really disappointed. Mm -hmm. Which is rare for us, but that's, that I'm, not, I'm not massively keen on that. Well, we've loved them so mm -hmm. far, the popcorn chicken. So Anyway, we'll get this down us next and we'll see you tomorrow, my loves. Thursday night, over and out. I'm going to show you that before I show you tea tonight. So I've done two batches of chickpeas uh, this week. Uh, these ones in the bottom are put aside for Spanish chickpea stew, that's tuna, that's hummus. Um, if you saw our random vlog which included Sainsbury's, you'll know that we're having baked potatoes tonight. Found the perfect way to make them, 15 minutes in the microwave, then 30 minutes in the air fryer at top whack, turned over halfway through. 
Uh, so baked potatoes, one with tuna, one with hummus, and a lovely big bowl of salad. Appreciated. Yeah. <laughs> um, so, hi Jason. Hi. Sorry, we're just looking at our photos on the television. Oh, it's random me. Random photos. What? Isis was there a minute ago. What comes up next, I wonder? The allotment. The Perfect. early days. The early days. Our first day there, I think. Uh, so, yeah, if you haven't seen my recipes for hummus and tuna, I'll whack them up there now. Dead easy to make. Instant pots are such a, a, a time saver when it comes to cooking dried ingredients, of course, chickpeas and stuff. Um, and, you know, you get loads of batches of stuff out of one batch of chickpeas, so it's great. So, baked potatoes, crispy on the outside, fluffy in the middle. Bit of flora light, as you can see it dripping out there. Uh, tuna on one, almost on the other. Salad, Friday night. Is it Friday night? It, it is. is, it's Friday night. Um, we've just whacked a vlog up today, a random one. You may have seen it. And uh, hopefully we'll see you all at the weekend. But you'll see this after the weekend. So why am I even saying that? Look at me food. I thought we'd just let you know, you've seen lilies featured on our mukbangs twice. You saw the indoor Chinese takeaway box and the pizzas. Yes. Well, tonight we've just kind of said we really fancy the takeaway. So we've come down to lilies to pick one up and we'll show you it when we get home. But first I'm gonna show you an egg because it's gorgeous. Look at me shadow, I'm such a bad vlogger. <laughs> I'm a bad vlogger, Jason. All this stuff here as well. Oh, I know, all this, uh, most of this stuff is clearly marked suitable for vegans, so. Fantastic, we love it, amazing. Now to get home and stuff us faces. 20 minutes later. Oh my darlings, it's Saturday night. Hopefully you've seen our little short allotment vlog today with our waterlogged plot. <laughs> uh, and tonight we just thought, we really fancied, well I, I did Jason. I said to Jason, I really fancy a takeaway tonight. I don't fancy cooking. We've not had one for ages. So let's support Lily's, who've supported us so incredibly well uh, in the, on our last two mukbangs. So read out what we've got, Jason. So what we have is... Um, well, well, where are you the, pointing? Well, the cauliflower one is a starter. Um, the Gobi Manchurian. Yes. Yes. And then... Um, we've got the naan, which is uh, chilli, garlic and coriander naan. Fantastic. We've jira got, rice. Uh, yes, jira rice. Uh, which I believe is coriander. I, think. I don't know. Uh, Kadai paneer. Which is this one. Please excuse my pronunciation. And ba Bengan Bartha. In fact, we should take the lids off. Uh, do you want me to take the lids off? Yeah, well, you... I'll tell you what, let me let our child in first. Oh. Do you know she's trouble, that girl? Yes, you eat your food and we'll eat our food. And let's not talk for a while. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, what good idea. Good idea, babes. Well, you can see it proper then. Yeah. Oh, look at that, guys. Careful, Brenda. You be careful. Yes. Everything looks amazing, doesn't it? I mean, sincerely. Yes, it looks so much better with uh, with the lids off. So we're going to literally fill these here empty plates with all of this wonderful plethora of stuff and have ourselves 
a gorgeous takeaway uh, which makes a, a huge difference for us we've not done it for ages so if you don't mind off we go hope you've had a great saturday well hello my loves it's the last meal segment of this one as you'll know there's been five meals in there and nary a lunch taste testing site because uh, jay's had a few days off work so this is from our live our sunday afternoon live today where we made french bread pizzas and we're about to finish them off i thought i'd leave the rocket off so that you could see it uh, but it's about to have all the rockets put on top of it absolutely beautiful i'll link the video up there if you fancy having a go at the recipe and we'll see you on the next uh, meal vlog and because i know it's the end of this one you know what i'm gonna say bye loves